Hey, Gemini gang. Happy Sunday, you guys. Let's see what's going on with you today. All Gemini placements take what resonates. Ooh, leave the rest. Take it how it resonates with you and your situation. Um, Gemini's, okay. All right, so let's see what's going on. Hit those likes, hit those likes, hit those likes. Also, what am I missing? Um, personal readings in the description box on the website. Uh, yeah, lovepeachgenesis.com. Y'all, my brain is all over the place this morning. So I don't know if this is your energy, Gemini's, or the person on your mind, but my brain is like really cloudy. Okay, so this is what we're seeing. This was on the top, so I'll take that one. So this is what is on top. So Gemini, something over, you feel like something's over, or this person feels like something's over because I'm seeing the death. Um, relationships over, no second chances, grow and transform. Now it could be that something's growing, all right? Grounding, karmic relationship, ooh. Uh, blowing kiss and engagement ring, all right? So let's see what's going on. So this one is sunglasses, which I've seen this before. Watching, looking, perception, and stalking, which I've been getting that for you guys. Somebody's stalking you, uh, Gemini's. This could be something you um, ended things with. Be careful. This is the golden mirror. Mm -hmm. This is It says narcissist, love bombing, self-absorbed, and one-sided. Be careful out here in these streets, uh, Gemini's. Let me get two more of these, Spirit. Two more, two more. Okay, so mm, this picture, ugh, it makes no sense. But this one is not enough. Lacking confidence, self-sabotage, ego and fear and frustration. So I kind of got this energy in the last reading, on yesterday's reading. Um, someone that lacks confidence, someone that kind of operates from their ego. Um, Gemini, some, some severe frustrations from this person. Anger, jealousy, and all that good stuff. So we're going to see what comes out because right now the energy is a little uh, sketchy. Now let me uh, remind you guys that um, Mercury is in Scorpio now. So uh, yeah, it's going to be a lot of shit coming up, okay? So we have love call, all right? Um, expressing love, messages of love, thinking of you, informing you. So if someone wants to talk to you, someone wants to call you, um, Gemini's. And then we have date on the bottom. So so you may be meeting somebody new. You're getting back out there. This one also says online dating as well. So some of you may be getting back out there, you know? Um, so yeah, let's see what's going on. The king of pentacles. Could be a Taurus watching you. Uh, Gemini's an earth sign, some some earth energy. Uh, Gemini's. So be mindful of that. Three of Cups. Someone wants to see um, what you're doing and who you're doing it with. Uh, Gemini's. Six of Cups. The Chariot. Mm hmm. And there's that King of Cups that we keep seeing in all the readings, all right? So, yeah, someone does definitely self-sabotage. And I feel like someone um, loves you a lot, Gemini's, and cares about you a lot, but they don't really know how to show it. Like, they don't really know how to um, express it, if that makes sense. Well, I won't say that they don't know how, they just choose not to do so. Um, because of their ego, because of fear, whatever. It could be something from their past as well, um, Gemini. Someone from their, their past, I feel like, may have caused uh, them to behave how they behave or something from their childhood uh, causes them to behave how they behave, Gemini's. But with the chariot here, I feel like you are going to get some communication from someone. They may even, like, visit you, um... Which would make sense, too, because we have the stalking here, uh, Gemini. So, yeah. Mm, child. I don't know. The Two of Pentacles. 
the Queen of Pentacles on the bottom. So you're dealing with a divine counterpart. Now, um, this person may like drive past your house or drive past your work when they're on their way to work um, or something along the lines of that. This person definitely watches you though. Yeah. I feel like they want to like, it sounds strange, but it's like they, they want to like catch you in the act. Like they want to like drive past your house or your job or whatever and like catch you with someone or see you with someone or whatever. Uh, Gemini's, it's very strange. Really? The King of Pentacles. Um, the fool on the bottom. Gemini's, I feel like you have someone else or you're going to meet somebody. Ooh, the chariot just fell out into my lap. You're going to meet someone else, uh, Gemini's. The chariot, the Knight of Cups, or this person is trying to prevent that from happening. Whoa. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I feel like, Gemini's, you're going to meet someone else. Now, I feel like though some of you guys may not be open to uh, meeting someone else. Now, usually when I start seeing like double energies, number one, it's just spirit reiterating what spirit wants us to know. I'm seeing a Knight of Cups. Mm, see, the Knight of Cups is here and I'm seeing it on the bottom of this deck as well. See, Gemini's look. There's more than one person here, especially if you're if this date card says meeting someone new. So some of you are going to meet somebody, a new person. And I feel like this person is going to be, uh, they're going to pursue you just as heavy as whoever this past person is. Um, Gemini's, whoever this past person is, this, again, this could have been someone that was like a love bomber. Or whatever the case may be but i feel like those seeing this inner the cards itself i feel like they don't want to be in that energy they could be wondering too um or they could be like focused on their finances and stuff as well uh gemini's but mm, look king of pentacles two of pentacles king of pentacles three of cups there's more than one person here gemini's i feel like you have more than one person the cherry is here and, and it may not be yet. You may not have this other option yet, but you will. This could also be someone that like, they may drive for a living. Like do um, a truck driver or I don't know. I even heard Uber. So they might like do that. <laughs> yeah. So do nice. <clears throat> you're going to meet someone else. And I feel like, yeah, you're going to have this, you're going to have a past person pursuing you and a new person uh, pursuing you. So be mindful of that. For those this resonates with. Yeah, see? Mm-hmm. Five of Pentacles. Somebody's having a money problem. That's what I got when I saw that Two of Pentacles. Ace of Cups, yeah, you have um, a new person, Gemini's. Yeah, you have a new person. Now, let me say this. I'm seeing the Seven of Swords on the bottom, y'all. Um, I don't want to say this person doesn't have good motives, but uh, now nah, I'm talking about the past person, not the new person. Now, I don't want to say that the past person doesn't have good motives with the Seven of Swords here. However, um... I'm just getting this aspect of this person doesn't feel totally ready or they don't feel like they can give you um, what you deserve, Gemini's, even if it's not something that you even necessarily care about. <clears throat> this person feels like they aren't um, really in a good space, uh, especially financially, and that may be true. Like they may be in a position where they're robbing Peter to pay Paul. Um, Gemini, and again, another way to look at this is someone feeling left out in the cold, felt someone feeling abandoned by you. Um, even if it, if it's all in their head, Gemini's, but that's that's how they feel, like you abandon them or whatever the case may be. Especially when this new person comes around, um, when this new love starts coming in, they're definitely going to be feeling some type of way. Really, Gemini's? Really? 
the two of pentacles again i'm telling you this person's not in a good place uh and i feel like for a lot of you it's financially especially where with this two of pentacles here under not enough lacking confidence this person doesn't feel like they um they can do for you or they can take care of you uh gemini's or or they can like match your energy and i feel like they show their insecurities in other ways instead of just saying this directly instead of just saying look i'm going through a hard time um i, I want to be my best self for you instead of saying that they would rather do bullshit like you know um, make you jealous, make you chase, and do all these other things. So I'm seeing the Fool, the Nine of Pentacles, and the Five. Yeah, especially with this Nine of Pentacles and the Oh, there's something behind there. Oh, yep, the Judgment and the Five of Cups. Yeah, Gemini. I feel like this person is is they're not um, confident in themselves in no way, shape, or form. They have no confidence, and I feel like you may uh, you may bring this person's insecurities out, especially if you're doing well financially um, and they aren't Gemini's. I feel like that you bring out this person's insecurities um, because no matter what, I feel like they may um, they may compare themselves to you, uh, Gemini's. Like compare what you have going on to what they have going on or whatever the case may be. I don't feel like that's going to stop them from like trying to do this again, but I would be weary. Page of Swords. Yeah. Seven of Pentacles on the bottom. I don't feel like they have bad intentions though, Gemini's, but especially with this, this love bombing, the narcissist, the self-absorbed one side and all that with seeing this energy. Now this could easily have been a past energy, but I feel like this person wants to like make an appearance so you don't move on that's that's kind of what i'm getting here like they don't want you to move on i told you with this page of swords here and this oh this chariot this person watches you again they may drive past your house past your job yeah they watch you like a hawk um and again with this page here though it could be you are going to start communicating with someone new um you may not believe it right now because i feel like some of you guys are stuck on someone um, but I, f I feel like spirit's going to wiggle you out of that. So go ahead and, uh, <laughs> get that on out your head, Gemini. Now, I'm not saying you, you should give up on this person, but, um, yeah, spirit, I feel like even if you don't end up with a new person, I feel like spirit is going to start showing you, um, possibilities with people that actually, uh, reciprocate um with people that actually communicate and i feel like it's, it's going to kind of change your mind about being uh, so obsessed or or uh cooked on whoever this is uh gemini's spirit's going to bring somebody to you that is going to show you that there's more out there like there's more to love out there um gemini's so just be mindful of that all right so the self-sabotage could also be you self-sabotaging a new connection. But yeah, um, Gemini's, I don't see this past person going anywhere, but I feel like they still feel like they're not totally ready, which I've been getting for you guys in a, in a, other readings. And it's like, this person is going to keep like trying to make an appearance to try to keep you from moving on. It's like whenever you, um, y'all are separated or whatever and you start to heal and you start to move past them they pop up yeah which which can it, it's giving toxic <laughs> it's giving toxic uh gemini's with this because um yeah it, it's giving toxic just a little bit now like i said i don't feel like they have any bad intentions towards you at all but um, I know you're my soulmate. Yeah, I, I, and I believe it. I believe they, they believe you're their soulmate. And that may be true, Gemini's. But I, I really, really feel like for some of you, spirit is going to bring someone else into your life. 
Um, and it may not even be someone you date necessarily, but like some type of example of like love or the type of love that you want. And you're going to be like, you know what? That's actually what I want. Now, I've, I've actually, I'm seeing it with my own eyes. I'm getting to touch it. I'm getting, um, I'm seeing like the physical manifestation of it. So this other person isn't going, and how they are, isn't going to look as appealing. Let me take you on a date, um, Gemini's. And I'm also seeing, cause, and those flipped over while I was shuffling uh, the deck, Gemini's. Now, I also feel like too, Gemini's, some of you may have uh, a self-worth thing going on as well, especially with this not enough, because this could be you too. If you are heavily desiring someone that isn't treating you the way that you want to be treated, then that is a self-worth issue. I know it, it sounds harsh, but y'all know I'm going to tell you the truth. Um, that That's like, let me give you an example, right? You're dating someone that is um, calling you names, right? Um, I'm trying to think of something that is like specific because y'all know I like to give y'all scenarios um say you're dating someone they're always calling you dumb like you're dumb like you you don't know this and that or whatever and you still stay with them it's because deep down you believe it you believe what that person is saying so that goes to show when you're dating someone that's a narcissist or someone that is that only takes from you and doesn't give it's because you deep down subconsciously believe that you deserve that so if you are wanting someone or desiring someone that isn't treating you the way that you want to be treated, it's because subconsciously you feel like you deserve that or you feel like that's all you deserve, Gemini's. And I feel like Spirit is about to show you that that's not the case. It's going to bring somebody else around you. Who was that I saw you with? <laughs> Spirit has a dope ass sense of humor. At least my spirit guys do. But of course, your spirit guys usually match your personality. Um, guy, and, hmm, yeah. When I say spirit, I'm gonna bring you, bring somebody to show you. Um, and then this comes out. It doesn't mean you don't end up with this person. It doesn't mean you doesn't you don't end up with the person on your mind. But the point is, I feel like your lesson here from this person, Gemini, is your self worth. Luxury Love by Mario. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. I dream about you. Yes. Could be dealing with a fire sign. A Leo, Aries, or a Sag. I don't want to be tied down right now. What did I tell you? What did I tell you, Geminis? What did I tell you? You deserve much better than me. Mm-hmm. This person also has a self-esteem issue. Unblock me, please. Yes. And I feel like the way that they behave is because of their low self-esteem, Gemini's. I'm alone, but I'm not lonely. Point of it all by Anthony Hamilton. Mm -hmm. Please don't give up on me. This person is confused as hell. They don't know if they want to let you go. They don't know if they want to commit. You're worth fighting for. They're confused. <laughs> I'm just playing you guys take them how they resonate I know you're the one for me see keep seeing that one all right Gemini's hit that like hit that subscribe y'all thank you for watching peace out